Good morning everybody and welcome to a day in my life, day in the life of me. I don't know what they call it but basically I'm going to be taking you guys along with me for my whole day. Um, It's not going to be a particularly exciting day today so I hope it's not going to be too boring for you guys but that's what you said you wanted to see over on Instagram so... Yeah, you're just going to be coming along with me and I'll be vlogging and just telling you what I get up to in a day, basically. So the reason we are starting in the car and looking like this is because it is currently 10 to 7 in the morning. I've just come back from my boyfriend's. I stay there most nights of the week um, and he gets up for work and leaves at half past six. So I always get up with him, help him kind of pack his lunch and then come home. I think it's my kind of way of trying to be proactive and get up and get ready for the day. But but 99% of the time I end up just putting YouTube on and falling back to sleep again. <laughs> yeah, I'm obviously not looking the best, so please excuse all of this, but this is my real day. This is what actually happens. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every time I bring out a new video. And yeah, let's get into my day. Perfect. The cat always meets me at the door every single morning. God, this is really not my best angle. Um, so basically every morning I usually have a orange juice and a coffee, but this morning I'm really not fancying a coffee, so I think I'm just gonna have a glass of orange juice. Again, please excuse the lighting because the sun hasn't fully come up yet, so this is what we're working with. Um, but while I've got this, I kind of like to sit and plan my day out on my phone. I write myself like a... T <laughs> yeah, I like to sit and plan out my day on my phone. And then once I've done that, I will literally just put some YouTube on my telly and sit and watch that for however long I've got before I need to get up. And usually this little lady always joins me. So what I'm gonna do now is have a quick bath. You can probably hear it running in the background. I don't usually do this in the morning or really ever. I don't really have a bath. Um, I'm usually more of a shower girl. Actually, let me move away because that is so loud. <laughs> um, but yeah, a couple of days ago, I actually had my implant changed. Well, I had it taken out. So I actually can't get it wet for a couple of days. So it's really, really difficult. Um, to have showers and baths and things like that and I really need to wash my hair as you can tell So what I thought I would do is have a bath and then use the shower in the bath to wash my hair And I think I'm gonna cling fill my arm up so it doesn't get wet This might not work, but I'm hoping it does because I can't like not have a bath or shower for days and days and days So yeah, we'll see how it goes, but my hair definitely needs a wash and yeah I can't be filming this whole video looking like this So I'm gonna have a quick bath now and then I'll be back All right, I've just had my bath and dried and curled my hair I used a new curler today. I used this one the Babyliss Pro um, my dad gave me a load of my stuff that I left at his house and I actually forgot that I had it so I thought I'd try it out and I don't mind it to be fair. It looks quite 70s, it looks very big so I'm gonna have to wait for that to settle down. But yeah, I am way off schedule as usual, I am always late for everything. <laughs> so I've literally just got dressed, done my hair, I'm gonna pop a little bit of makeup on now but I've literally just got jogs on god the sun let me move out the way of the sun i've literally just got this top on which you've seen in a couple of videos and then my joggers because i'm going over to my granddad's today to do his cleaning for him um so i don't need to wear anything fancy and just something nice and comfy so yeah i'm gonna pop a little bit of makeup on now um hopefully that doesn't take me too long because it's already 10 o'clock already and I was hoping to be leaving here at quarter past 10 so that's definitely not going to happen and my makeup is now done so what I think I'm going to do now that took me like 45 minutes but what I'm going to do now is go and grab some cleaning products that I need to take to my granddad's house um basically the reason I'm doing his cleaning is because he had a cleaner before covid and all that stuff um and we just thought it was a little bit weird for like a random person to be going in his house especially as he's still being really really careful with everything so i offered to do it i do my mum's anyway so i don't mind at all and it's nice for me to see him every week as we've been away from each other for so long right i've got my mask on and ready to start cleaning Ooh, i've just come out of my gramps i don't even know what i look like 
sweaty right now i think i'm back in the car and i'm gonna go to tesco um i've got a bride in for makeup tomorrow and i need to grab some false lashes so i think because i did all that cleaning i'm gonna treat myself to a meal deal so we're gonna pop to tesco grab a meal deal for lunch i just got back from tesco's i am absolutely shattered i haven't eaten anything yet today which is probably why so i did get myself a meal deal so we're gonna do a little tesco haul <laughs> So when I get a Tesco meal deal, I usually get the Caesar wrap, the chicken Caesar wrap. But today I just fancy something really simple. So I got the ham and cheese sandwich. Um, I know it's really, really boring, but that's what I fancied. And then I haven't had these in ages. So I had to have them. They're literally my favorite squares and they changed the packaging and they're a lot bigger which is good so got myself some salt and vinegar squares and if you guys haven't tried this drink you need to try it it is the innocent bolt from the blue i wouldn't call it a smoothie but it's just like a juice but it's got guava lime apple coconut water blue spirulina and vitamins it says in it and it's literally so so good and it's part of the three pound meal deal which i didn't expect but you can see i've already drank some of it in the car because i was dying for a drink oh so cold i'm gonna kind of chill for a little bit eat my lunch i think i'm gonna catch up on sam and billy fairs you know the mummy diaries I literally watch that every single week. I love it and I missed it last night. I always kind of watch it on catch up anyway because I like to watch it like over my lunch break or something like that. I'm never usually in to watch it on a Thursday night. So I always watch it and record it and watch it on catch up. So yeah, I think I'm going to watch a little bit of that now. I might not watch all of it because I do have some other bits and bobs to do. So I ended up watching the whole episode of The Mummy Diaries. I knew I would if I put it on. But now I'm just so chill and I just can't be bothered to get up and do anything else. Basically, Basically, I did my acrylics a couple of weeks ago and yeah, these three happened. One when I was cleaning at my gramps today and a couple just because I think they needed infilling and I hadn't done it for so long. So I think I'm gonna go upstairs now into my beauty room and soak the rest of my nails off. And if I've got time, I might repaint them with gel now they've grown out a little bit more because they were really short. That's why I put acrylics on them because they were just ruined. I think it's maybe about half past three now. Um, so I'm going to go and soak off these nails and see what time that takes me till. So these are my nails before and here are my nails afterwards. I'm not going to show you them for too long because they're really short and stubby and gross. I really wanted to do some like funky designs on them, but... It literally took me like two hours to do that. So I just really didn't have time to do any nice nails. So I've literally just got a clear gel on them for now. I think I said to you guys, I started that at three and it is now 10 to six, which is amazing. I have also just transformed my beauty room into a makeup room for my makeup ready for tomorrow morning. Cause it's an early start because it's a wedding. So I'm all prepared and ready for that. Here is my little makeup room transformed obviously the nail table is usually there and then this is all a bit different as well so i've moved the trolley over here with all my makeup on my ring light and my little director's chair right we are back in the car um it is currently 10 past six and i feel like i just needed to get out the house today i've done kind of boring things so i thought this vlog was going to be super super boring so one of my favorite things to do is take the dog out and recently me and my boyfriend went up the hill near us and just sat and watched the sunset and it was so nice so i just rang him and we're gonna go and do that now and take his dog in the car up the hill and just go for a little walk and watch the sunset and i thought it'd be nice to take you guys along with me i feel like there's a chance we could miss the sunset i don't know if you can see but the sun is very low we'll see we're just led in it and it's way better than sitting up there we're like so protected from the wind <laughs> now we're to 
sky. Oh, it's just blocking the sun. <laughs> I've just got back home. Um, I've got myself some dinner down here. I'm not gonna show it you because it looks like absolute crap on the plate. <laughs> but yeah, that was such a nice walk. I've came home. Usually I would stay at Rowan's, but because I'm working early in the morning and I've got to edit this video, I thought I would come home, do all that, and then I can wake up nice and early in the morning. So yeah, for the time being, I am gonna sit, eat my dinner, start editing the video, and that's about it, really. I'm still in the same spot, still editing. Um, it's Friday night, so I usually do all my editing on a Friday night. I literally just do like a long stint of it where I will start at like as early as I can and go till like one o'clock in the morning. But because I've got my wedding tomorrow, I do need to be in bed quite early. So I've done as much as I can. I'm not completely done. But on a Friday night when I am doing my editing sesh, um, at nine o'clock, I always have a little break for an hour and me and mum watch Gogglebox. So we did that this evening. I forgot to vlog it, um, but you all know what Gogglebox is. I just watched that for an hour and then got back to it. And I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna be here for the rest of the night. So I may as well just sign off this vlog here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching a day in the life of me. I hope it wasn't too boring for you all. Let me know if you wanna see these vlogs more regularly, days or weeks in my life, just vlogging things that happen. I really enjoyed filming this. So let me know if that is a thing that you guys wanna see. See? As I mentioned earlier, don't forget to like, subscribe, and if you want to be notified every single time I upload a video, as soon as I upload it, make sure to hit the notification bell as well so you don't miss out. Thank you all so, so much for watching, and I will see you next Sunday.